The community-based Kunk Management Project in East Grand's Bahama to wrap up its second public meeting in the Eastern District tonight. The project is funded by the Inter-American Development Bank and led by the Bahamas National Trust with the goal of enhancing the livelihood of fishers in East Grand's Bahama. The first meeting was held in Sweeting's Key yesterday. Science officer within the Bahamas National Trust and project manager Jewel thompson Benaby says they are getting a good response from residents. Is it just going to be more regulation on Kong? That was one of the biggest concerns. Is there just going to be more regulation? But what we're trying to do is come from a place of empowerment because if a fisher fishes a conch and they get a certain amount of money for it for just the meat, what we're trying to do is form an association with those fishers so that they're able to get more money from each conch through not just the um, value-added products that can come from conch or whether there's a, a conch farm, but also when you, when you work together like that in an association, you're actually able to get a better price for your product. Now another meeting is set for tonight at St. Michael's Church in High Rock and it is hoped that after these meetings an association can be formed to explore and set up a conch farm in the east. There are more opportunities for increased revenue and livelihood through conch uh, fishing and that can be alternatives like conch farming where we're making sure that you know there's a there's a successful breeding ground for conch, as well as that can serve as um, a, a means of other opportunities, such as ecotourism ventures. There is a conch uh, pearl farming that can happen. There is, you know, so many opportunities that can happen that are just may not that may not be um, fully considered or being explored at the minute. 